My name is Cyprian Johnson. I was a Biafran child. I was one of those children in Biafra staffed by Yakubu Gowon. I suffered from kwashioko due to hunger and starvation, coupled with bombs raining in my village every day. Yakubu Gowon boosted in a recent interview how he defeated Biafra. Quote, we did it in his advice to Bola Ahmed Tenimbu not to listen to critics. Since you don't listen to critics, this video is to stop the hunter you go on from rewriting history. You will be remembered as a war criminal, no more, no less. The once powerful general speaks now with a weak and shaking voice. The frail old man, when he was a young Nigerian general, decimated more than 5 million innocent people in Biafra, precisely Igbo people by using the weapon of hunger and starvation. See your life today. I saw a frail old man on television who was being forced to speak in Hausa language by the cabals who were directing him like a puppet in a press conference. Poor old Gowan. You see what is happening to your people in Niger state? Hunger. Hunger, I repeat, and that was your weapon against us, the Igbos. The weapon you used against us in Biafra is now haunting you. Go on, there is no redemption for you. The ghosts of the Igbos you killed during your war of genocide will continue to haunt you. Go on, the survivors of your war of genocide are here to tell the story. I survived the war. I will not allow you to pollute the minds of people across the globe by making them believe that my hero, Odume Wojuku, started the war. Do you remember this slogan? On a bury we stand. Go on. Can you remember that? Can you remember what happened in Aburi? But you denied the agreement. You lied against the innocent Odumegu Ojuku. The war could have been avoided had it been you respected the Aburi Agreement, which you signed. You came back to the barracks, tore the agreement, and declared the war against the Igbos. So, go on. You should remain silent.